Hell yeah, brother. You're on the Please Me Fun YouTube channel. What's up, guys? This is kind of like my usual Ruby intro where I'm driving to the racetrack, but it's dark out. I haven't driven Ruby uh, past dark in a little while. But... So we're back from Australia. We are heading to the track right now for our first competitive drag race of the year. And I'm driving Ruby this weekend because she was ready to go as she always is. I was gonna put the bigger turbo on before we got here, but we ended up leaving it alone because she's so dead nuts consistent. And uh, tonight I'm actually doing the roll racing. So I actually won the Bradenton Street Car Takeover roll race at the beginning of 2019. I'm hoping I can hold it down, get uh, our first win in 2020 tonight, and then it'd be cool we get to be Ruby's first win. Ruby's never won a class or a competitive race ever since we built her. It's been a year. So I'm really hoping to start the year off right and win the 150 mile an hour class with Ruby. That'd be pretty sick. So we'll be there in a little bit, but it's cruising. Beautiful night out, windows down. Gotta love Florida. Gonna have some fun tonight. I don't know, I'm confused as can be. These cars aren't starting from a dead stop. Ah, uh, yeah, dude, what the hell? Roll racing? Weird. Give us a quick explanation of a roll race, how it works. Well, you see, most adult males, they start their drag race from a stop. <laughs> These roll racers do a whole different They start like 30 on mile it. an hour. Yeah. 30, 40 mile an hour. Like you're on the street or something. That's it's weird. wild. Well, I'm going to go try it. I'm going to try a test run. See what happens, dude. I mean, I mean, it's Ruby. You can pretty much you'll throw, figure it out. throw anything at it and she'll do it. You'll figure it out. A little roll racing action. This is Ruby's first time. The only rule in my class is I can't go over 150 miles an hour. If I were to go up another class, I'd be competing with twin turbo Lambos that do like probably 190 in this amount of space, so I'm in the right class. Might have to turn her down a bit, but we'll see what it does here, see what kind of boost it makes. The car hasn't been touched since we left, so. So are you racing Cletus in this? Yes, sir. Heck yeah. What are we looking at here? Third man. Firebird. Yeah. Nice, nice. Just your basic turbo LS. All right. First round of the 150 class. Cletus drew that third gen. Both single turbo LS deals. Come back from racing our third gen in Australia, and here we are. Racing a third gen. Hey, this guy's cool. We've actually been racing with him for a while. He's got a nice third gen, it's a beaut. Alright, here we go. First round of the 150 class. Cletus versus the third gen. About to take off. like just over 150 yeah but I got scared to hit the brakes because yeah, it's it's a tough game to play I know but uh, he actually broke out he went over 150 yeah so just over so even if I would have uh, no I would have yeah if I broke out worse it, so okay yeah. so I, I don't know dude I just kind of was like oh, I don't want to be right over just couldn't tell because there's no speedometer in this thing so. you just kind of gotta cross your fingers that's right brother boys we're out here uh, we're racing a ZL1 that has a 2650 Whipple on it. This should be a good run. And then if we win that, we're in the finals. So this car's gonna be fast. So the 10 speeds make a ton of, like, they use their torque really well. So Yeah, and they're so, right in the gear when they leave. Yeah, they're in the gear. We'll get out of there, let Ruby do her thing. Semi finals. Get Ruby or win. We 
guys think he's got this? He's got a faster car, but he can't go over 150 miles an hour or else he loses. What? Yeah, he's in 150 mile an hour. Because he's in that class. Well. All right, here we go. Modified Street coming at you right here. Ruby machine. And Mike coming out of the left hand side. The ZL1. Look at that little nitrous purge coming at you from Spring Hill, Florida. Oh, he purged the nitrous big time. Six to one forty two. and stuff i was like worried but yeah i was so far out i just got out of it save the car and fuel and yeah. not break out i think his car was breaking up oh damn i would have liked to see that car make a good pass because he's got a really nasty setup in that thing yeah that thing's sick so all right we're in the finals dude yep. ruby okay. might be able to seal us our first win of 2020 i'd Man. be so proud of her because you know she didn't get a win all year <laughs> Nice. Let's see what our girl. Make it happen in January. It'd be a good year. Let's go, Ruby. Come on, start the year off, brother. We're racing a twin turbo Gallardo. Yeah, I saw it beat Justin. Justin. He's been. He How went just 149 every pass. Yeah, so we're pacing good, and then once he starts getting close to light, he just took off, and I took off too. But I kept that same car length almost all yeah. the way through. I mean. We're almost the exact same mile per hour all the way down the track. He yeah. does have two turbos. He does. I got yeah. stock at 1.7 lower. Hey, so are you going to run a 940 in this thing this week? Or not, you're over a 920. Yeah, 920. It'll run 920. Orange ZL1. 920. Yes, sir. Old Nemo. So, Old Nemo. you guys don't know Justin, this is one of the owners of Streetcar Takeover. He's actually got a YouTube channel. You should check it out. Yes, sir. Stang Killer. Stang Killer Productions. UGR, he's a 1R, uh, but today we're running it on pump gas. So. Yeah, pump gas, so it's, it's like 1,800 horsepower capable on race gas. Yes. Pump gas says 1,100. It's about 1,100 horse. Yes, so that's what's probably making tonight. Yes. Nice. Yep. Nice. Absolutely. That's a bad unit, brother. Thank you. Appreciate it. Hopefully we get a clean, fair start. Have a good run. Ground racing twin turbo Huracan. All the badass versus uh, Ruby. That Huracan's been dead on accurate on its mile per hour. So, I mean, uh, not a Huracan, a Gallardo has been dead on accurate. Here we go. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Launch there. No pretty much sure launch. There was a uh, no launch. I started going, but I guess he wasn't ready. Oh, he 
beat him. Justin's car. I you mean, were playing catch up the whole time. Yeah, I had to play catch up the whole time. His car hung with it better than this, but I was mile an hour. Like I had to get all the way in it to even get close to catching him. And then I was gonna, I was gonna break out. So I mean, the tune-up's way closer than it was when we started, but I still would have gone 153 or 154 easily. So yeah. got out of it, tapped the brakes. He kind of pissed him off, but Ruby got her first freaking win out here, dude. Ooh. Starting off 2020 right. All that matters, dude. Reigning champ in the. Roll race 150 class, two years in a row now. One with the Supra, one with our girl Ruby. So freaking wow. bog deep, brother. Look at that, dude. And she's ready to drive home. Nice. She's out here, dude. She's nice. doing her thing. Hit the road and go get some sleep. Come back, do some drag racing tomorrow. Running tomorrow, drag race. Spotted up. A river over there. Yeah, she's not coming off the trailer for roll racing, that's for sure. <laughs> Hey dude, you gotta, you gotta join it when you can. We got some data on Ruby now, dude. We know right, right where she's liking it, dude. Yeah. So. All right, guys, that's it for today. We'll be back tomorrow. We got roll racing coming at you. For now, thanks for watching, dude. For Dale, we'll freaking see you later.